guys, welcome back to Legendaries Unleashed and another collection video. Today I'm going to be going over my breakthrough set. So as always, I'm not going to bother showing you the commons or uncommons because that would take a ridiculous amount of time. We're just going to jump right into the hollows. And before I do, I currently don't do trades, so any of the cards you see are cards that I've collected myself. So let's start off with the hollows here. So we have a Vivian to start, and if you notice on the top here, it did get crimped in the packaging process, which means that I'm hoping to eventually get a, another one that doesn't have that defect. I have a couple of the Chestnut card, one of the Typhlosion card, two Octillaries, two Magnazones, and this is the card for me from this set that I, the very first time I pulled it, I didn't actually realize it was a rare because unless you have the light hit it a certain way, which is working right now because I've got a lamp because it's a little bit later in the day. Um, you don't actually necessarily realize that it's a hollow, so it's kind of like the Mew from the Fates Collide set. And my favorite hollow from this set, the Gengar, which I've been lucky enough to pull three of this card. Let's see, and three. We have a couple Miss Magius cards, a couple Mamoswines, again, a couple Gallade. I've been really lucky with getting quite a few uh, hollows from this set. Meloetta, Evaltal, and Haxorus. So I have lucked out and gotten quite a few hollows from this set, but I am still missing four. I'm missing the Empoleon, Raikou, Zoroark, and Xerneas card. So moving on to the break cards here, I've managed to pull a couple of the Raichu card, a couple of the Marowak, Actually, I think I've gotten quite a few. Yeah, I've gotten like four of this Marowak card. I keep forgetting. Uh, I just recently pulled this Zoroark, but I did have one already pulled. And a couple of the Noivern. Super awesome to get that many break cards from a set, but I am still missing the Chestnut and Florgez. So moving on to the EXs here. Oh, I always love moving on to the EXs. And especially this set because I really, really love the artwork from this. We've got the, oops, we have the Houndoom EX. Oh, the Mega Houndoom EX. Absolutely beautiful. Mega Glally EX. We have the Mewtwo EX. I think I have two of this one. And another Mewtwo EX, but the uh, different version. So for the EXs, I'm still missing the Glally the, and two different Mega Mewtwo cards. So... To finish off here, we're gonna finish with the best, of course. Always leave the full arts to last because they are just the coolest looking things in these sets. So we have the Houndoom EX full art, the Mega Houndoom EX full art. Absolutely love this card. We have the Mega Mewtwo EX. I think this is why I just really love this set is these full art cards look absolutely crazy. We have Mega Mewtwo X, EX, blah. We have two of those. We have the Mewtwo EX second secret rare. So this is the card number 164. And the Trainer Bridget card. So the full arts that I'm missing, I'm still missing the Glally EX, the Mega Glally EX, uh, two different Mewtwo EX full arts, Giovanni's Scheme, and the secret rare card number 163. Wow. So many more cards than that Fates Collide set, but I feel like I've opened quite a few more of the breakthrough packs, and I absolutely love the set, so I'm not complaining at all. But I'm going to leave it off right there, guys. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, please don't forget to comment, like, subscribe. I'll see you next time, guys.